Audi will reveal a new King R8 at the 24 Hours of Le Mans. That new Porsche Macan has peaked. Mercedes SL gets turned into a sexy ass shooting brake concept. And Nissan will offer a Nismo GTR next year. Plus, we're gonna head to Russia, where some people are doing it wrong. Seems to be coming from Russia a lot often. I heard that. Yeah, what's up everyone? I'm Derek D, and you're watching Fast Lane Daily. What is it now? Yep. <music> Nissan's performance division Nismo has left its mark on two models, the Juke and the 370Z, with some good results, I might add. Now the Nismo Touch will extend to an even more hardcore version of the Juke. It's titled the Nuke. Yeah. No, it's not. Really. Oh, come on. I'm just kidding. It'll be called the RS, which will improve on the Nismo Juke's 215 horsepower, 1.6 liter turbo four, while adding some more styling flair, if you will. Don't get this confused with the GTR power Juke R. It's not that. It's still pretty impressive though. Also, a Nismo version of Godzilla has been approved as well, Godzilla being the Nissan GTR, of course. And this means its current 545 horsepower twin turbo V6 will be upgraded along with its suspension and styling. We don't have an exact output figure for that yet, but Nismo is promising a substantial bump in that department. In other news, King Kong is still pretty angry. He doesn't have a car named after him. Pissed. He called earlier and said, what's the deal? I took that call. Yeah. I told you about it. I know. For all you shoot and brake fans out there, as some would say a wagon or estate, here's another sexy example of how to do the sloping roof line right. Studio Torino has envisioned what a Mercedes SL would look like with the shooting brake touch, and yeah, it looks good. The results are looking fly, fresh to death. What's cool about this is the students who are behind the project accounted for engineering and cost to produce. That means this could realistically be built if Mercedes likes the idea, of course. So what do you guys think? Do you dig it? Do you dig the music in this video? Let us know in the comments below, right? Yeah. Porsche's compact crossover, the Macan. We haven't really talked about it for a while, but it's been testing for quite some time now. And we've got a few nearly undisguised pictures of it compliments of Motor Authority. Putting all Porsche SUV haters aside, this thing looks pretty good. It does. That's my personal opinion. It should go on sale in the spring of 2014, and I got a feeling that this model will sell pretty well. Oh yeah. Right? Yeah. Come on. The starting price is 49 grand. Yeah, not cheap, but easily the cheapest Porsche model available, so it's gonna sell. Though we only see a five-door version pictured, a three-door is also possible, similar to the Evoque setup. As far as engines, there'll be a few different flavors of V6s with a potential Macan Turbo bringing 370 of those things that make this noise when running. Uh, yeah. There may be also a 3 liter turbo diesel making 300 horses and 480 pound feet of what, Erica? Torque. Torque, that's right. I'd say it all sounds pretty good and looks good too. Yeah. You like it, Tom? I think I like it. Yeah. It's like a smaller Cayenne, but looks good. Audi has a few versions of their R8s. You got the regular 4.2 liter V8, there's the V10 model, a V10 Spider, and the top of the line R8 GT. Now it appears the German automaker has another more potent version on deck, the R8 GT Plus. Set to debut at the 24 Hours of Le Mans this weekend, the GT Plus will boast a tuned 5.2 liter V10, making more than 552 horses and 398 pound-feet of twist. In the rear-wheel drive version, a six-speed manual will come standard. Nice. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. But the all-wheel drive version, well, that you're going to get a seven-speed dual clutch. It will look at uh, 60 miles per hour in the face until it's to shut the hell up in just 3.4 seconds. Wow. Whoa, aggressive. Yeah. And top speed should be in the 200 mile per hour ballpark. I want to go to that ballpark one day. Me too. Yeah. yeah. There will also be a Spider version released next year. I've always been a fan of the R8. Yeah. Sharp car. Tony Stark drive one. Oh yeah. Drives one, you know. Hey, let's head to Russia and watch multiple people in this slammed car doing it wrong. Yes. Mm-hmm. First, I'm pretty sure they made an illegal right turn to avoid that first speed bump. Then, they stop the car in the middle of the road, and three dudes get out to put down ramps so this thing can get over that weak-ass excuse for a speed bump. I don't care if you think this is cool or not, it's just dumb. 
I mean, if your daily driver is slammed that much, you're doing it wrong. Yeah. Uh -huh. Would you agree? Yeah, put hydraulics in it so you at least lift it up. Yeah, there you go. Solution. God bless you. And listen to the music in this video. That's doing it wrong too. I don't know. That's, that's, that's Maybe it's just not my style. Yeah. Derek, it doesn't bring you back to the old country? No, not at all. Thanks to FLD fan Shugan Shreshla, hope I said your name right, who posted this doing it wrong video to our Facebook page. Thank you for it. Jimmy Fallon. Come on. Come on, Fastlane Daily. What do you say? Come you're, on. You're gonna, right, guys? Yeah. Erica, tell Jimmy Fallon to come on, Fastlane Daily. Come on, come on. Say Jimmy Fallon, come on, Fastlane Daily. Jimmy Fallon, come on, Fastlane Daily. Please. There we go, now it works. See? Go to getjimmyonfld.com for more info. Tweet at Jimmy Fallon and make sure you use the hashtag getjimmyonfld. All right? And it'll work. Trust me, it's gonna work. That'll do it for Fastlane Daily on this Tuesday. I'm Derek D. You're awesome for watching, and I'll be even more awesome if you check out FastLaneDaily.com. Also, follow us on Twitter, like us on Facebook, subscribe on YouTube, iTunes, Instagram, T-shirts, FLD app, and Vine. Max is just headbanging every time. Oh, yeah. Got that there. All right. We will talk to you guys and gals tomorrow, which will be a Wednesday. Bye. Camera, camera speed. Slating, please. Body, take four. And thrive in the land of the new Jersey. I'm your man. Peace, I'm out of here. Leave it there. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it there. Wait, where's the focus? There we go. You know what I don't like about this camera? What? I don't like that it has a red light. I liked seeing the red light. You don't like that it doesn't have a red light? I wish it did. It does have a red light. Then I could see. It's over here. Yeah. yeah. Just for I me. like seeing the red light on top of the camera. Yeah. We should have a system of mirrors. Yeah. <laughs>